Okay. The thing about Harriet is that she often doesn't know what's good for her. See what? Uh, see her two front paws? They're bandaged up because she has a rash, and she can't stop biting the rash and injuring herself. So, you know, I had some vet tape put on both her front paws so she can heal from the rash without constantly re-injuring herself and biting herself, okay? And she's also developed the habit of biting her own back. That's where there's little bits of gap between the fur. Yeah, you gotta watch this little dog because I don't know. Um, she's hard-headed. I love my dog, but she can be a problem sometimes. But, you know, they're animals. We care for them. We do what we got to do. Hey. Hey. We do what we got to do for them. Because they don't know not to bite on injury or not to keep bugging at it. And to just let it heal the way people do. <sighs> also, you might have noticed I keep her away from other people and from other dogs and cats and such. Yeah, she doesn't tolerate other people. She doesn't tolerate cats or dogs. If she sees another dog, she's going to bark at them and get rowdy. She doesn't like most people. So, yeah. Taking care of Harriet is <laughs> difficult, man. <laughs> I didn't, when I was adopting her back in November 2020, I didn't realize she was the most difficult dog they had at the Humane Society. <laughs> I had no idea. I thought it was just a cute little dog that I was adopting. And yeah. Oh, there's behavior issues, all right. Hey, hey. There's behavior issues, all right. Yeah. She's a little devil. I'm dead serious. She doesn't like other dogs. She doesn't like people. She doesn't like cats. I take her places where she can roam and be free, but, you know, without other people and pets around. And, uh, yeah. I care deeply for my dog, but she wants to be... She can be a headache at times. A lot of people would have uh, quit on her a long time ago. I'm not the type to quit. You adopt a dog or a cat, you adopt a pet, you're responsible for them for life. You should never neglect them. You should always treat them, right? Yeah, I get that. And I'm holding myself onto that. But damn it, Harriet can be so difficult. <laughs> and people don't know. They're like, oh, so cute. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey, there's a bird. Hey, there's a bird. See? There's a bird in the distance. I'm surprised Harriet is not chasing the bird. Oh, wait. She prefers to chase squirrels or something. Yeah. She prefers to chase squirrels or something. Yeah. So every day, I got to make sure her bandages stay up. And I got a jacket that I make her wear while she's in the apartment so she can't bite her own back. Really hoping her, the rash on her front paws heals quickly so that I can take off these bandages and make sure she doesn't take them off. She's, I don't know, man. She's difficult. Ah, I see other people walking around with their dogs. Their dog seems so attentive, so well behaved. Mine's a little demon. Yeah, a cute little demon, but a little demon nonetheless. Hey, stop doing that. Ah. 